Hey guys, welcome back to Let's Play the or Let's Play Legend of Mana. There's no the in it. In the last episode, we finished the Lost Princess by finding Pearl with the help of Elizul. So now that we've got a couple more artifacts, we want to lay those out real quick. Now, I don't want to lay the Firefly Lamp quite yet, but I will lay the Stone Eye. The Firefly Lamp is going to go beside Domina. And it's going to bring my shade ranking all the way to level 3, which will trigger an event that we'll do shortly. We don't want to go there quite yet either, because it's starting to get a little further away from home. And the further places are away from home, the stronger the enemies become. And, you know, I'll show you all the proof of that later. But that's how, uh, that's how the game mechanics level up their enemies, basically. Now then. Now we want to go explore Domina around a little bit. Uh, that's the inn. Let's go in here. We can talk to a bunch of people. Oh, this is the inn. Never mind. That's the innkeeper. That's her little peewee. This is a door. That's the beds. That's a closet, I'm guessing. Let's see, and that's the door that we just walked into. Let's go upstairs, see if there's anything worth my while up here. What do you know? A treasure chest with some bird meat. Chicken leg, probably. Ooh, that sounds good. What's, what, dang it. I'm selling the minerals I've mine, mine, mined around here. Bunch of stuff I don't really need right now, but I will be buying some from her later on in the game. For other reasons, y'all will see later. Let's walk up into this building. This is the Knights of Gemma. What's a Gemma? We'll find out about that later. The Minos Bronze. Ooh, and some. These are the. These are how we use magic in the game. Um, there's nothing here that I really actually have to have yet. That thing's turned to stone. I wonder why. Well, we'll find out later. All right, let's walk to the right and go up to the church, I believe. Yep. Talk to this little guy. Ex Inspector Boyd. I've heard that bandits appear here. If you see anyone sus suspicious, report to me. We'll be talking to that guy more in, later in the game. There's a lot of things we can talk about now that can't quite do. My name's Niccolo. I'm a traveling merchant. The highway is full of bandits. It's too dangerous to leave town. Don't you think so? No, I don't. How brave of you. I can't do business with those highwaymen about. Let's go teach those bandits a lesson. After we're done, I'll make you rich. Okay. Niccolo's Business Unusual. Hey, we got a new party member. I still need to stop and see Tipo. Come with me. Yeah, we'll do that in a sec. I want to go... I wanted to go up there, but I guess I can't. I want to go in there, but I guess I can't. Can I go up in here? There's another Spratling. Everyone with the soul always disappears. We don't have souls, so, souls, so we always say. The poet Pokil said so. I hate Spratlings. <laughs> That's sweet. Alright, let's go back down here and talk to Tipo. Tipo is in this little area right here, I think. Yeah, I think that's Tipo. Why, it's Niccolo. How have you been? I don't like this guy's voice. It's hard to understand. Actually, I have a splendid item today, but I can't just let it go. You're just trying to rile me up. This is it. It's a wheel I picked up on the highway. Fine, I'm going. You're right. Nothing special. I'll take it. That's a lot of lucre. And 
until then, I'll let Brian use it. We got the wheel artifact, which we won't be giving to Tipo right there. Ooh, let's talk to this dude real quick. Oh, he didn't want to talk to Oh, there we go. I thought getting Rachel a job would help her cheer up, but you were wrong. Oh, yeah. Let me give you this book about weapons and stuff. Oh, thanks. I already know everything, so I'm not going to go over it, because it, it, it would take about six episodes to go over that. Because there's so much stuff that we can't do yet, but we will sooner or later. And when I say sooner or later, I mean later. Well, my tree's starting to grow a little bit. Now then, we'll grab the wheel, and we're going to put that right beside the house. Ooh, ah. I do like watching how the lands grow back. Luan Highway. On a gin day. Well, might as well go see what's going on on the highway. Won't have time to make it to the boss fighting here, but we'll make it pretty close. Hey, is that Pearl? Did you get lost again, stupid girl? Oh, Brian. Um, I, I got lost again. Well, aren't you just dumb? She's blind, so I'll let it pass. <laughs> Alright, nothing we can do to help her right now. I don't really want to talk to the pumpkin guy. So let's just go over here and start fighting on the main road. Well, there's our rabbi. Yeah, that, look, that should look familiar to anyone who's ever played a mana game. No, quit taking my experience. I hate it when my teammates take my experience. Ooh. Animal meat. Ha, I got them all. Keep on going and take on a couple more rabbites. Ooh, I jumped over it. Didn't mean to, but... And I hadn't been able to hit them yet. There we go. See, so far this game doesn't lag very much compared to Final Fantasy IX, but I'm sure that'll change sooner or later. Okay, experience. No, don't take it. Alright, let's keep on going. And there's a, some more things to fight. You know what? You're done. Boom! And Niccolo's doing his little trick, too. I like watching it. <laughs> Explodes. Pick up the candy. Okay, pick up the candy. I want some candy. Get the experience. Crystals, I guess. I'll keep on walking. Oh, we finally made it out of there. What's this? Looks like a cat. Hello, I'm Deina. I come from Gato. Hey, anyone know what Gato means? It's cat in Spanish. Did you come to see one of the Seven Wisdoms? Wow, what cute ears. We were meant to be together. A bunny and a cat. I want to see that on YouTube. I wasn't talking to you. Well, that's not nice. Came to see Wisdom. Where is Gato? Who are the Wisdoms? Let's find out who they are. Gaius, the earth, is what he is called, and should be near here. That's great. We'll find out more about the wisdoms later. After the lag, of course. I'm going to go down here first. Fight these things off. Kind of gain some experience, because the men, the, uh, boss that we're going to be fighting on here isn't isn't a pushover compared to in previous games that he's been. I mean, I shouldn't have a problem, but I still need to level up just a little bit. Let me show y'all more battles as it goes, if I ever kill these things. Alright, keep on walking down here. There's also a couple items and new enemies that I can get, so that's why I'm showing y'all this right now. 
after I pick up all the experience. Alright, I don't feel like messing around with this guy. And my time's getting low, so yeah, I'll just slash the hell out of it. Get a little experience. Might have time to make it out of here. Yeah. That's about all the time I have for this episode of Legend of Mana. In the next episode, we'll fight the boss of uh, the highway right now that's uh, causing Nicola, Nicola to not be able to do his merchant business stuff. Yeah, I don't really know what I'm talking about. Anyway, I will see y'all in the next episode. Thanks for watching. This is the Tigers Are Here signing off. Have a good day.